Please tell me I'm not about to fuck up my whole life. Feel like I might be, but you know, I like Capella. And I didn't save her earlier. So I'm gonna do right by her and save her now. She's a sweet girl. And I believe that Capella is our future. So I just drank that thing just to hurt myself, really. Sick. So... I have two panaceas. I'm going to go see what the town wants. Over at that spot. Right, which is over on that side. And then... Talk to Capella. I want to save her. I like her. She's dope. She's a cool ass, cool ass kid. Cool little bitch. You know what I'm saying? Tired. Okay. I'm fucking, fucking nervous. This plane, no one gives a shit. Wait, whoa, did the water just increase my immunity? No, okay, it was just random chance. <laughs> Say you can't take your half, it won't be let on the train. We're going on foot. Okay. That's what I was supposed to learn from that, I guess. So now, now I'm going to go to the, mm, up through there to the fucking, I have a knife, yeah. To the, who? Oh, fuck you. Oh, shit. Take you, 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 and you. To come to her immediately without delay. Let's go. I'll come on my own. It's not up for discussion. We'll take you back by force. Really knows how to win people over. Oh, shit. Well, I have the panacea, so that's good. A tumor. That's what it is. Proverbs are stories just seen from a distance. Is this too much for you to even listen? Even to listen? I guess all you feel is seething indifference. I can tell it's a poem, but I don't know where it's from and I can't recite it with you. You can't know it. For you, it's not yet written. Well, let's get back to the prose. I was right, of course. The outbreak was caused by the tower's creation. Both outbreaks, actually. This is the second time Sandpest has occurred in this town, correct? Must feel great to solve a riddle when you already know the answer. Yes, the first outbreak. When was the tower built? Damn. The ability to correlate facts is a useful skill to any investigator, Barack. And a surgeon often serves as one too, wouldn't you agree? I'm not a diagnostician. Once again, I prove that first impressions have never failed me. The initial hypothesis is almost always correct. That's exactly how things turned out to be, literally and metaphysically. Metaphysically? Are you for real? Any attempt to subvert, subvert nature is met with resistance. That's the nature of nature. Such is the matter you're made of. Whether a person or a town, they tried to subvert nature. It retaliated. The case is clear. Can you prove this? A bachelor helped me figure it out. He spoke to the uh, stomatons, the canes, many people. I don't have time to give a full accounting. We meet here for you to report to me, not vice versa, and I haven't su had sufficient sleep for far too long. Even I have my limits. Well, if you have figured it out, at least tell me how it remains in the air. Don't ask me how they achieved it. The Polyhedron's foundation pierces many meters into the ground beneath the town, to its very heart. It's like the barb of an arrow stuck in a wound. Why have you grown pale all of a sudden? How, how do you even know about the heart? I only confirmed its existence several hours ago. Calm down. I'd prefer you not to have a heart attack. I was speaking figuratively. Were you speaking literally? Yes. 
I think you're overworked, sweetheart. I know it sounds mad, but the blood of Aurochs might be underground, and lots of it. Bro, that's... Oh, that's that um, pierce that we saw inches away from the heart. It was probably getting closer. Okay. I see explained briefly, but don't omit crucial details. Get to the point. A certain kind of bull used to be dissected in the abattoir. The blood was poured underground for many centuries as a ritual. Soil is special here. The blood may still be used to make a panacea. panacea. Imagine a circulatory system below the town, a maze of tunnels and chambers. Somewhere down there, blood flows. We could extract the blood, but digging wells is forbidden here, and no one would let us drill. Damn it. Wait. Soil is special here. I understand. Now, please be quiet for 25 seconds. I need to think. There's blood underground. The polyhedron's base pierces the soil like an arrow's bar buried in a torso. So all we need is to pull out the arrow and then blood will pour out, killing the wounded. Huh, I expected you suggest that we demolish the abattoir. You made that decision suspiciously fast, killing the wounded. We have a solution now, a clever one of which I'm particularly proud. So you may not have saved my life, but you did help me save my professional honor. Intuition never fails me, but I'll need to get proof. Otherwise, they'll refuse to demolish that wretched edifice. How do you plan to demolish it, finding workers in these conditions? Artillery, Barak. Military, this is their direct obligation to shoot at the town, so let them shoot its least useful part. Sure, everyone has to play a role in the Inquisitor's plot, right? Thank you, Doctor. You have assisted me in solving the puzzle. Nothing more is required of you. Stand by until blood pours from the ground. Be ready to make a great deal of your medicine. Wait, you don't understand. You can't just bleed the earth dry. If it's truly a living creature, it will die. Get some rest, Doctor. You're clearly overworked. Do something else, or are you not busy enough as it is? I thought Inquisitors were required to be open to belief in the impossible. You just don't care. Puzzle solved right to hell with everything else. I am, and I feel like the real work's just beginning. That's what they mean when they said spill rivers of blood. To make the pansy, I require an underground river of blood. The polyhedron spike wounded the earth like an arrow and clogs the wound. Remove it and blood will flow, but that which is wounded will die. A difficult decision awaits me. Fuck. Not chill. And now I have to run all the way up here to fucking do the... Time is it? Shit is fucking spiraling. What's up, bro? Which side are you on? I'm a doctor. You know what they say. Everyone's on their own. And only God is on everyone's side. See how it is here? Fucking trigger happy idiots. Fucking moron shooting our own. Why? There's a split. Some follow the general. Others follow Longin, the executive officer. What do you want here? Can't you see we're done for? Huh? Huh? A split. Tell me more. Heads up, I said. I said raise your hands now. The doctor. I'm leaving. Dude, what the fuck? Do be happening. So the polyhedron pierces into the heart. I'm gonna... Yeah, fuck it. Let's go... So, I believe the children are our future. Gonna go up on the polyhedron, see what's up. Mm, this is fucked, dude. This is so fucked. I believe the polyhedron is our future. <laughs> Are they all taken already? I have so much more to climb. Shit took forever to climb. I did it a while ago, but I died. Why did they build this? 
So, oh, okay. So I'm trying to sort this all in my head. So Isidore Barak, my father, wants me to save the children to recreate the town and let it grow. What is this? The world is very beautiful indeed. Okay. So... Right, wants me to save the children, recreate the town, let the sand pest take its course. Uh, she's gonna pull, uh, pull the plug, the panacea, the blood is gonna spill. <sighs> Fuck, what are all those... Shit is wild, shit is crazy. It sounds like it's gonna fall with me on it. So that's me looking at the connections, I'm guessing. I'm guessing that those are things mo normal people can't see. That's me seeing the connections. Kill one and the rest will suffer too. Uh, so I need Overseer Sh Tashik. Children are gathering on top of the polyhedron. Is there a way to go up more? <laughs> this is the tippity top, I guess. Is it? So fucked up. I don't know what the fuck to do anymore. So this is me being able to see all the connections. So I need to plan where I want to go next, the hospital. Is there a boat I can take to get closer to it? Yeah, I can go there. That's fine. And boatmen will bring me into infected areas, but not out of them. And the blood doesn't, or the, the, the plague doesn't affect them because of the blood. The plague is actually the earth retaliating for the polyhedron. And uh, that's all I know. I have two panaceas. If I played my cards right, I could have had six. And I could have saved a lot of people. But I played my cards way, way wrong. And uh, got zero. Well, I got two. I need more blood. I wonder if I can go back into the abattoir. Dude, this shit is crazy. Where is it even pierced? You know what I mean? Like, where does this even pierce into the ground? I'm gonna drink some more Twyrine. Just in case. It's like it's not even a real piercing. It's like it's uh, like a, some sort of like metaphysical piercing. That's wait, are they okay? They were we're walking. It just the draw distance was being weird. I was like, oh, they're sliding around now. Cool. Let's see if uh, Kane has anything to say. What time is it? It's already fucking two. Let's go talk to this motherfucker. He's just sick. I, believe I don't know why I keep singing that. Oh, shit. See, and if I zoom out, 
It's a bull. Where's its head? So that's the heart. The stomach is the fucking ah, Jesus. I'm gonna drink some water. Pretty hungry too. So I'll eat this fish. I'll drink this water. Just to curb curb all that. Curt all that for now. Ugh. This game, man, this game is fucking me up, son. This is probably some bullshit. Who's this? That's Capella. I'm gonna go save her real quick. I like Capella. The fuck, where's that motherfucker running? Yeah, I'm gonna go save her and then give the other panacea to... Or go see what the hospital needs. Tell me I'm not about to fuck up my whole life. Feel like I might be, but, you know, I like Capella. And I didn't save her earlier. So, I'm gonna do right by her and save her now. She's a sweet girl. And I believe that Capella is our future. Yes? Thought I was a mistress, that it was my destiny to defeat this plague, but it turned out differently. I guess this is goodbye, Artemy. First, there's nothing good about any of this. Second, I won't give up on you. I'll help you. They were all taken away from me on a train car. Everyone under my wing. The future of your town. Of the town. I know. Take care of Khan. He's in the nutshell. You care about him a lot. Very much so. Do you love him? No, not yet. Does he love you? I don't know. And truly, I don't care. You wouldn't understand, but we must be together. For the good of the town. Is there anything else you can do? Anything at all? It's not over yet. I'll think of something. I'll get more of that thing, the panacea. You'll all get better. I just need time. Please take care of my children, if any are still left in the town. If any are still alive, someone must be. I can tell. But my senses are clouded by pain. I can barely see. God, it hurts so much, so much. Take care of yourself and hold on. Fucking blood, man. It says clothes. Let's just run by clothes, see if I can buy anything. Some boots or some shit. I don't know. Just to look cool. So that music means I'm I'm a good boy. <laughs> It's like 2 a.m. right now and I'm going a little, little nuts. Uh, it's, it's 1200. I want that. Let's upgrade my inventory. I want that. What can I sell? I sell a bunch of shit. I don't care. I'll sell that. I'll sell that. Do I have anything else that's like worth a lot to you, you pieces of shit? Let's 
so up and then back down. So I'll save my stamina. And then I'll sprint over here. If, oh fuck, this is rough. So if, uh, did that dude just die on the stairs? <laughs> I'll loot you. <laughs> I just watched his corpse fall over and I was like, ooh, goodies. <laughs> what a douche. All right, so fuck me. So, um, can you trade? I'm trying to trade? Oh, you got that good, good shit. How much is this? One? Nah, I'm not giving you shit, bro. Show's over. Doctor, entry's forbidden. There's nothing of interest inside. What do you mean? We have received a clear report. Everyone who gets infected dies. There's no cure. There's no chance of salvation, so why would you need a hospital? It only makes the germs swore. There is a chance. You got it with you right now? This division doesn't disobey. The general is very strict about the chain of command. Beast of a man. I've heard a lot about him. Sick. Hospital's closed. Casper Kane. This is murky. That's Grace, isn't it? Oh, fuck. Notkin's dead. <laughs> Oops. Maybe I'll try going here. Damn, son. Yeah, because I need to try something because I have the cure. Excuse you. My immunity was going up for a second, even though I was in the shit. Weird. Grocery. What's up, dog? What's up, dog? What's up, dog? Who's singing? Why are you singing? Oh, shit. Who you be? Name? A doctor wears general. State your business. Urgent. General is sick. The professional is Captain Longland. I'm a doctor. Let me examine. General Block is out sick. Captain Longland is now in charge of the quarantine measures. You can try your luck with him when he's back. How did he manage to catch it, I wonder? He was here in the headquarters. There was no plague around here yesterday, and it needs at least a day before it shows. Wake up. I'm a doctor. Where's the general I'd like to examine? Okay. He caught it while evacuating everyone under the age of 16. What do you think you're doing? The door is over there, doctor. Does the commissar uh, Lilich know about this? Over there. I'm not one of your junior junior officers. Lieutenant. You fucking piece of shit. Talk to me like that. Who are you? Okay. Yes, coops. Nothing in there. Okay. What is down here even? What the hell is this? I've never even been down here. What the fuck is all this? Sorry, I'm going crazy. I'm like using FPS skills because I'm trying to get this shit fucking dunzos. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Divide I took all my wards and it drags them towards death. In the termitary have to fight my way in. To make a different difficult choice. I'll spill rivers of blood. Step people meet at Sabas. Now how to touch the apostate's heart and convince them to come back. Uh let's see if there's any like Minku knowledge. Tincture. 
tinctures. Okay, um, damn. It's already been an hour again. I'll run back down and I'll go talk to Taya, I guess, because shit fucks. Cure two of the kids. Make them absolutely healthy. I just don't know what else to do, man. Let's see, so there... Shit, I knew there was something in there. Fuck me. Let's see, I'm... Okay. I think I can... How many fingernails do I have? Where are they? Seven still. Okay, I think I can go there. Dude, this is- this is- this game is stressing me the fuck out. I am fucking stressed out. So let's see, so yeah, this is- They say the Inquisitors got arrested, or they'll catch her soon enough. It's for the best. The army will protect us. I imagine the soldiers will be happy to get her. They've always hated the, these commiss commissars. The government gives her free reign. Who cares about them? Authority comes from armed soldiers and a train with cannons. Have you seen those cannons? I haven't. I should take a look. Bandage. She only wants water. I'm not giving you four waters, you fucking crazy. Can't jump in there? Cool. I can go see there and then there. What else do I want to save? Murky, Taya, Grace. I kind of want to save Grace. She can hear the fucking... Jesus! This is ridiculous. Why am I so stressed? Fucking stressed as fuck. Okay, no one cares about me. That's fine. Okay, let's start sprinting again. So it's in the middle building that the shit is. Have I been in here? I don't even know what's in here. What's in here? Town called to me and said, hey boy, you better check out. Oh shit, that scared me. the shit out of me. What is in here? Where do our dead go? We can meet man of heavy hands and a blood and misfortune. Can't smell it anymore myself. Got used to it, I guess. When I think of it, we have a lot in common. I reek of misfortune too. Our whole house does. Sorry about your loss. Today I dreamt of earth. I went to a cemetery barefoot for some reason. I saw human bones in the snow melt. Down below my feet, why? What was the purpose of my life? You're asking the wrong questions. You've had your life, and that's enough. How old are you, Ian? Even early 20s? Simon's gone. Uncle Gregory can't protect us. Mother is dead, and father, oh, father. And me, who am I? I need to be like mother. Do what she did. Oh, no plague would dare touch us while she lived. She was a true mistress. Just don't follow her direct. Who do you think you are talking to me as if we are equals? A doctor. This plague came after me to challenge me. Am I a mistress yet? But no, I'm not. Ah, uh, what do I do? By blood, if not... Your mistress, by blood, if not spirit, lives some more. Perhaps you'll grow into it. Nothing. Although, what about working as a nurse? You're a mistress, all right. I don't want to die. So don't, aren't you a kind of... Okay. Three graces. I don't know if I ever talked to this bitch. Oh, god damn, my son. Damn, son. So, so, I'm, I'm guessing that music, that, like, fucking humming music and shit is because I'm, like, deciding right now. You know what I'm saying? I have till 8 a.m. tomorrow to choose who to save, and it's gonna be her. I'm gonna save Grace. I, I'll, I'll just tell y'all right now, I'm gonna save Grace. She's dope. Also, she's already had a rough life. So I'm, a, I'm gonna save her. 
all the other kids are gonna die, which sucks, but I can't save everyone, you know? Shit's fucking brutal, son. Let's see, wait, how do I get the, yeah, okay. Shit is rough. Dude's gonna try and fuck with me. He better not. I'll fucking cut him up. I don't give a shit. Come over here. <laughs> fuck you, bitch. I'm just gonna fucking autopsy you so I can sell something to this dude. There we go. I'll give you this. Yeah, you give me that. Cool. There's something else maybe behind his house? Maybe the backyard? Like, I don't know. Is there, like, a fucking... Maybe in there? I just don't fucking know what it wants me to do. Who's screaming? Is there a way for me to get in there? Maybe. Uh. Ow, that's my jaw. And this is the only other place I can think of. Bro, what does it want? The fuck does it want? I just don't know. Not very hungry. <sighs> God damn it, I don't want to talk to you. There he is. Get out of here, you fucking moron. I just don't know what the fuck it could want me to do in here. And I'm just wasting time. And we'll pick this up next time. That's for you, Polar Bear, to edit.